Hey, today I want to show you how you could put on a generic YouTube watermark, a subscribe button, and also your own custom watermark. So hang on, I'm going to get on my computer and I'll show you exactly how you do it. It's extremely easy. See you on my computer. There, now that I'm back at my computer, I want to show you how you can put on your YouTube watermark. And the what I'm talking about is this little button down here. Whoops. That little button down here, my subscribe button. So when people get on my videos, if they click that, all it does is automatically subscribe them to my channel. It's extremely easy to do, but I'm also going to show you how you can put your own watermark on depending on which one you want and either one is is okay with how you want to go so i'm going to go to my channel and when i go to my channel i'm going to go this is youtube studio and there's a creator studio and youtube studio they're about the same i believe it's going to continue to go to youtube channel youtube studio excuse me but when i go here what i'm going to do is i'm going to go all the way down to settings and when the settings, it talks about different things, but I want to go to channel and I can put my tags in there, but I also want to go to branding. And this says, this is what I have on right now. I'm going to show you how to do that. So I'm just going to remove it. And then what it does, when you come to it, it says, choose an image. So I'm going to choose an image. And all I did before I get there is I'm going to go back to this channel if I can. I'm going to hit cancel. Sorry about that. What I did is I went to Google and I just Googled YouTube subscribe buttons. And what this wants is what they call a PNG, meaning the background is transparent. So I downloaded this. I like the word subscribe on it. I downloaded this. So then when I go back to my channel and I say choose an image, it comes up here and I've already downloaded. I actually downloaded two, but I want the word subscribe on there. And I just put it up now. What happens, do you see what it did? It changed it to end of video. I don't want it at the end of my videos. I want it to be at the entire video. You can do a custom time. Some people have it coming after a couple minutes. I want entire video. So I'm just gonna click save and there's where it is. Now, when I go to one of my videos and I'm just gonna go back here to one of my videos and you're gonna see that as they play Let me grab a different one. Here is a how to make your YouTube channel banner. And I just want to play that. I don't want to see it here. Let's go to this link. Sorry about that. Um, what you're going to do is you're going to see there's my subscribe button. And that's where that's at. So how cool is that? Now, I also want to teach you how to, I'm going to stop this. I'm going to teach you how to do a um, branded watermark. If you have you know, your own color schemes or whatnot. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to Canva. This is a free service. So, and I, I use it quite a bit, but I'm going to just, I, I've already have my channel sitting in here. So I'm going to get in here with Canva and, oop, I don't want to get started. I want to log in. Boy, I tell you, sometimes they, these things, they change too much. They don't change too much. I'm sorry. Here, now we'll just log in. So I'm going to get to Canva, and I'm going to create a design. And it asks to do different things. I'm going to do custom dimensions, and I'm just going to go 400 by 400. And then I hit create. And this is really easy to make. Now, this isn't going to be a... Um, this is going to be a Canva design. So what you do right away is here's your image. It lets you choose the color. And I don't know your color schemes or whatnot, but you can put your own color up there, what you, what you want. But you can also go to different ones. So let's just go to, I'm a blue man. I want to pick that blue. And it can be any. So I got my blue up. And I'm going to go to text. And I'm going to add a heading. And I'm going to write click, if I can spell it, click here. <laughs> and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to make this a little larger. So I'm going to go down to 56. 
and I'm going to spread it out a little wider because I want it all in one and then I'm just going to raise it up and then I want another one and I'm just going to write the word subscribe and I want this let's go really bigger see if I can put it to 96 and it might be way too big and if it is I'll just change it and that is like I can't get it on so then I'm gonna go I can put my own in there let me go to 84 and see how I just put the, the 84 in I'm just gonna hit enter and it's still too big so let's go to 76 and I'm gonna play with it <laughs> it's not gonna let me do any of that so I'm gonna go back and do a 64 oh I was so close let me do a 62 I should have played with this before but I didn't. There I got it. All one line. And you can do different fonts. I like this font. Uh, but some people like different fonts. You can change it. And of course, what happens when you change to different fonts, this size might. And so all I'm going to do is download it. And it suggests. Well, it suggested PNG, and that's what I want. So I'm just going to download it. And it's preparing my design. And that's where it's there. So now I go back to my YouTube channel. And I'm going to go back to the original part of my channel where it says I can get it to change to Studio Beta. So I'm, I'm back to the very front end. And again, I'm just going to go to YouTube Studio. And then I'm going to go down to Settings. I'm going to go back to channel. I'm going to go back to branding. And I'm going to replace this one. I could either replace it or remove it. And let's see where that went. I'm going to go to downloads to see if that popped in. It's right here. And when I open that, now I got to play with this because right away now it says it stayed an entire video. So, and that's what I want. So I'm going to hit save. And now I'm going to go back to my videos. And I'm going to choose a different one. Let's to uh, start a home business and see if I can get that one up right away. And it's, I want to get to this one. And there it is. And it says subscribe. Now, I probably won't leave that there, but that is so easy. So I have a quick thing. When we talk about this, now this one is you want to start a home business but have no clue where to start. I have a great free resource for you about how you can generate leads. And generate leads is right where it's at so how you can grow your business. So that's in the description below. But then click on that so you get that free resource. But then also click on here and subscribe to my channel. I come on every Tuesday and sometimes Tuesday and Friday, but I come on every Tuesday for sure. So there you have it. How easy was that? You all take care. Bye.